Breaking news. Japan and Techcho, still waiting. For the special nuclear coolant promised by Hillary Clinton, on the 3rd of December 2011, being delivered by the US Air Force. The US delivers coolant to Japan nuclear plan according to Hillary Clinton. They're going to be sending this special coolant. And this story was posted right around 3.11 on Friday, March 11, 2011. So they're still waiting for Hillary Clinton. So if you ever get around to it, if you become president, maybe you could send this special coolant to stop the meltdowns. The United States has transported coolant to Japanese nuclear plant affected by a massive earthquake and will continue to assist Japan. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton said on Friday. We just had our Air Force assist Japan transport some really important coolant to one of these nuclear plants, Clinton said at a meeting of the President's Export Council. You know Japan is very reliant on nuclear power and they have very high engineering standards. But one of their plants came under a lot of stress. With the earthquake it didn't have enough coolant, Clinton said. Well that plane never came with coolant. And it was more than one plant. It was several plants. The U.S. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton sought to convince Shizek leaders to pick U.S. firm Westinghouse over a Russian rival for a $10 billion nuclear power plant project. The country's biggest ever public energy tender would help to ease the former Soviet bloc's nation's energy reliance on Russia. So much for the nuclear reset. Huh? Remember when they said they are going to do a reset? So they were trying to compete with Russia, basically with their border nations, on every single aspect, really. Using intimidation. Majority state-owned Shizek firm says has applied to build two new reactors at its 2,000 megawatt, 10 million nuclear power plant which would be one of the world's largest public investments in Europe this decade. Westinghouse, a union of Japan's firm Toshiba. We are not shy about pressing the case for Westinghouse to expand the 10 million nuclear power plant because we believe the company offers the best option for the project in terms of technology and safety. Clinton said at a news conference after meeting with the Shizek Foreign Minister Carl Schwarzenberg. Safety, eh? Yeah? So we clearly hope that Westinghouse will receive the utmost consideration at this process most forward. Says Central Europe's biggest energy group with a market capitalization of 17.8 billion wants to pick a winner and sign a contract by the end of 2013. Says throughout a bid from France to Riva in October saying the company failed to meet crucial requirements. The Shizek Anti-Monopoly Office cannot sign a contract until it rules out Arriva's appeal. There will be opportunity for the Secretary to support Westinghouse, a senior staff State Department official told reporters. It could be great in a lot of ways for American jobs. American companies for energy security and diversity in the Shizek Republic, for jobs in the Shizek Republic, for scientific innovation and partnership with the United States. Building them files. The United States is stressing Westinghouse safety record, given concerns about nuclear reactors following the Fukushima disaster in Japan. We're still waiting on that nuclear special coolant. Anyway, when are you going to send it? Officials will also underline the advantage of reducing the Czech Republic reliance on Russia for energy. No one going to testify me, Seth Rich! Huh? I'm rich! I'm rich, bitch! Clinton will also discuss energy security with EU officials in Brussels on Wednesday. The Secretary of State's visit to Prague follows U.S. Assistant Secretary of Commerce Nicole Lamb-Hales' trip last week. 
Lamb Health said the U.S. Export-Import Bank would be interested in financing the deal if Westinghouse is chosen. The Shizek bid to expand its nuclear capacity has run into opposition from neighboring Austria and Germany, who fought long and hard to rid their country of nuclear reactors. The later plans to close its nuclear plants in the wake of Fukushima. Great thing that a woman did in Germany, probably the single best thing she did was get help to get rid of nuclear in Germany. And then you have Hillary Clinton coming along, the American who just did the very opposite of what Merkel tried to do in Germany. I would be pissed the hell off. According to U.S. officials, the Czech Republic currently gets 60% of its oil and 70% of its gas and 100% of its nuclear fuel from Russia. Broken news. Japan and Tecto still waiting for the special nuclear coulant promised by Hillary Clinton on the 3rd of December 2011 being delivered by the U.S. Air Force. The Air Force has responded that they have no idea what the Secretary of State is talking about. 